Hello everybody, welcome to the Champions Cup match between myself and uh, Andre here. There's the Champions Cup thing in the corner. Um, he's actually got two tackle pommers, which is super, super annoying, and two wrestle tackles. So normally these skills on zombies would be blow and crap, but when they're tacklers, that's pretty good against elves, right? Dirty player as well, four ghouls. Um... His mummies are really good, but because they're strength 6, it means that I can't even try to deal with them. So they might even end up being worse, because they're so good. Like, if they were strength 5 and guard, maybe I could get in a system, block them, and try to push them away. But they've got stand firm, and they've got strength 6. So I can't even hope to deal with them. <laughs> so that actually might make them worse. Um, and then I bought an extra player, because I was already giving him, giving him enough for a wizard. So I thought, if I give him a bit more, he's only going to get a babe. Or if he gets a star, at least he hasn't got a wizard. Um, and add five guy, which is really good. Movement nine guy, which is really good. Mighty blow tackler, but there's really not a lot to this team. Let's say it's 1950. There's uh, not a lot of skills there. But hopefully, hopefully it's good enough. Yeah, his, his is very TV efficient. Much more TV efficient than mine, for sure. Honestly, Finny, they're, they're identical as far as I'm concerned. I could not tell them apart. But, you know, that's just me. Yeah, so he's got the wizard. And if he gets a crappy star, which you can't know, he just gets a pay. I mean, I'm not. I'm unlikely to cast him or make KO, so I think I was definitely right to get 13th player there. For sure, it could go overtime, couldn't it? So, I think I've definitely did the right thing, getting the 13th man. Good chance of somebody dying in this match, so if I win this match, it won't be bloat for the next game. <laughs> if. Big if, though. I think this is. I think my team is better than his, but I don't think it's 210 TV better than his. And if the Mighty Blow Tackle Pommers. Uh, if the Mighty Blow. Mighty Blow Tacklers, I was going to say, but they're not even Mighty Blow Tacklers. If the Tackle Pommers do some good work, it's going to be very tough, isn't it? Thanks, Finny. He's got the whole whole match to take out this movement nine catcher now. Hello. Thanks, Agent Wenger. Thanks, Chipmunk. <laughs> yeah, I remember Leon. Yeah, it was quite good, wasn't it? I seem to recall it being quite good. Can I have Leon in the stands eventually? I liked it enough. I liked it enough, but... It could do a little bit of art from it one day. I'm loving all the art, even though, even though I'm shit. But then, of course I'm shit, because I've just started. Yeah, these tackle pommers are a nightmare. It's really, really good against my team, this, isn't it? You know, having two tackle pommers, having two wrestle tackle. Like, if this was against Artemis's team, for example, Artemis would have steamrolled it. No, no problem. His ghouls are shit. So his lack of relative lack of tackle wouldn't be so bad, um, and this this wrestle tackle would be blow on these two, and he would take out the mummies easily with Clawpon. So if this had been Artemis Black's first match, he would have he would have pissed this. It would have been the easiest game of his life. Whereas the goblins would have been the easiest game of my life because you know goblins versus elves they just can't stop them, can they? Um, <laughs> For, for Artemis Black's team, yes, 100%. 100%. Artemis Black's team was not good at winning games, really. Particularly good at winning games with Blood Bowl. Um. <laughs> yes, thanks. Thanks, Pedro. Yeah, that is the good thing about the art, isn't it? Um. Hello, Super Kikoni. Big Peen. Did you see the picture I've done of you? I've started it. I've started the Big Peen. Um. Yeah, so this is quite good. I can't even hope to fight the mummies. So I don't even need to try. That's that's good, isn't it? Um, so bezel probably wants to go on the LOS, doesn't he? So bezel, I ah, know he's, he's, he's moving five. He has got wrestle, which is pretty good. Wick's new dog. <laughs> he doesn't. I didn't even know Wick didn't have a name. You know, I I uh, I hadn't seen John Wick two till the other day. And uh, what's funny about John Wick two is. In New York, there's apparently more assassins than there are homeless people, which is uh, 
surprising, isn't it? News to me, I would have, I would have expected to have seen more homeless people, to be honest, on the streets of on the streets of uh, New York than than murderous assassins. But there you go. That's apparently not true. He doesn't have frenzy. <laughs> it seems that way, like Fenny, and yeah. And all the home, and then he exactly got in. It was hilarious. I watched it, and I, I literally said, "Wow, there's more, there's more, uh, there's more." <laughs> I said, "There's more assassins." I said, "There's more assassins than there are homeless people in New York." <laughs> and then, and then I was like, and then just as I said that, literally as soon as I said that, you see the homeless guy. And then he's an assassin as well. <laughs> Incredible. Right, he's in 17, so he can't level. Probably in the entire tournament. The other, the tackler, this guy in the LOS, is he in 46, so he could, he could level. So I'd like to engineer the touchdown onto him, if possible. Um, so I guess, actually, let's just do that. Let's just start him like this. Doesn't need tackle on getting punched. On a blitz. All right. Hello, Satterfield. Satterfield. Oh, really? If only I had an Edge 5 player to pick up the ball. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8. Lob it to the other one. Flip me, guys. You can hit my injured man. Oh, I don't want you to hit my strength four, man. Guess I've got no choice. Really hope I uh, <laughs> make the pick up here. Il a le ballon en ligne de mire, mais va-t-il pouvoir le ramasser? I do this block first. Il s'acharne sur ce pauvre joueur, comme des halves bling autour d'un sandwich. Oh, get the fuck out! <laughs> Glorious. Glorious! Zippo Papa Biddleboo. C'est très futé! Ils ont pris le ballon en plein sous le nez de l'équipe adverse. Let's get an SPP. <laughs> 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 oh shit. Good. <laughs> that was a bit of a dickhead pass, wasn't it? Um these are the finals of the Elite Division, Squirrel Dude. It is just playoffs. It's first round playoffs, so I thought putting finals in the title was the done thing, wasn't it? Especially by people who always get knocked out in the first round. <gasps> Woo! <laughs> Oh shit, I made a joke. Oh no. Oh no, that must mean I'm toxic. Flip me, guys. <laughs> um, because, Chipmunk, sometimes um, people try to surf you and if you spot it too late that you can be surfed from an unexpected place and you try to put it on manual, you uh, miss it and then you can't do it. And that's happened to me before. So since that day, I like, I saw, I, I, I was, I like, I ended my turn and then I was like, shit, he can surf me. So I frantically tried to make dodge optional. Uh, <laughs> oh, promises, promises, careful. <laughs> <laughs> so yeah that was 
it's shit that if he, even if he piles on with one, like a lot of the time if you're playing Chaos, like you know if Chaos had a tackle pommer, tackle claw pommer, like uh, like Artemis has one, doesn't he? Uh, he doesn't have block, but he's got tackle. Oh, had <laughs> I should say, if you've got one tackle claw pommer, when they pile on, you can you can fuck off the other side and stick a non dodge guy on him and. You know, if he wants to blitz with him, he's got to blitz an irrelevant player far from the action and all this kind of stuff. But with him having two, it's very, uh, very powerful. Very powerful. <laughs> Glorious! Oh, I need to uh, I need to open I need to open Streamlabs. That's for that. I should do my turn as well. Thank you very much for the sub. And uh, whoever you are, it doesn't come up properly on my fucking thing. My fucking it's really annoying since they, I don't know what they've changed. I think it's to make you use Streamlabs OBS rather than normal OBS. Carl Double O eighty nine zero zero eighty nine. Oh, it's come up on the screen now. There you go. Thank you very much, Carl. Welcome to Team Fantastic. Glorious. Um, it's tough to hit him, isn't it? I could, I could put the guard in and then mighty blow tackle him and then hit him. But then my mighty blow tackle uh, is in a dodgy spot. Glorious. <laughs> Um, so I'd really like to do that. I can't even fuck with his uh, <laughs> with his mummies. I guess I could put the guard there, and then hit him from there. Yes. Yes, we can do this. Mighty blow, tackle him. Smash him to fucking pieces. What I really want to do is uh, stick myself on the sidelines with uh, nowhere to go. <laughs> no escape from the mummies. That seems <laughs> really smart, doesn't it? It doesn't seem really smart, no. Seems pretty stupid, actually. So let's give ourselves an outlet. We have an Edge 5 guy over here. <laughs> Be nice to have cast the, the guard, wouldn't it? Yeah, it's not going badly. It's not going badly. He might wizard here, though. But then there's no real recovery if he does, so I don't think he will. I probably shouldn't have been carrying him. I should be carrying on this guy, actually. I just did it because he got catch, but I'm going to have to hand off to him at some point. Hand off to Wick's new dog at some point, because then he's like kind of a shit player to get bolted. Or even this dodge line will be a decent carry. Yeah, pretty dumb of me carrying on my uh, best player there. Well, not best, but he's one one turner, isn't he? Yeah, it isn't going badly, is it? It's not going badly. I mean, made, made a removal, right? So that's good. Uh, for the drive, at least. Haven't taken a Kaz yet. On turn one. Sorry, Super Kikoni. I, I, yeah, I, I put him on there. So that he wouldn't... Uh... And he got a chain to block as well. Fucking clever bastard. I had to follow to, to occupy his thing, didn't I? So I really should have pushed him to that square. Could I have done that? No, I couldn't. I couldn't have pushed him. I really, maybe I should have greeted the hit on him because if he'd been knocked over, that would be much better. 
Oh yeah, in Blodge we trust. Uh, just, just roll good. Ruzi, who I probably should have had a wrestle catcher, but I just didn't get the chance because um, this one got movements. Then I thought he's going to carry the ball, so he's got block. This one got mighty blow, so he got block. And this one had already taken block first. So, <laughs> um, that was just me. That was good. Yeah, it got in the pom hit. Oh, that was clever. Oh, annoyingly. Annoyingly good play from Andre there. Oh, <laughs> two whiffs on Pom. Glorious. Haven't given him an hour seven to hit yet, though, so that's good. That was a clever chain. Clever little chain that he got zero reward for. Ha ha ha! It is very nice on Dead Kit. Yeah, it's the one that I use. Exactly, yeah, there's plenty of time for him to roll good on the palms, of course. Plenty of time for him to roll good on the palms. Nah, no, there's a lot to be said for getting the removals early, to be fair. I don't think you can say he should do that. Oh, oh, he's hitting me bludger. He's going to pound me bludger. I knew he'd fucking pound me bludger. Fuck's sake. I knew he'd pound me bludger. I knew I should have dodged away. Fuck's sake. <laughs> Fuck's sake. I knew I should have dodged away, but I thought, I don't want a 1 in 36. Oh, flip me. Yeah, his, his mummies are probably worse than normal mummies because I can't even try to fight them. Like, I would have tried to fight normal mummies, but I can't even try with these fuckers. to foul, but at least he doesn't have mighty blow, uh, you know, dirty player to foul with. And if he commits the whole team to a gang foul, then his drive's fucked. Oh, the ass naff turn is not set to resurrection, oh shit. Yeah, you might have to. You might have to remake it, yeah. At least you allowed uh, fucking experienced teams in though, so. The Fantastic Wood can be in, even though they've already played 10 games. Glorious. I just couldn't be bothered to make a new team for it, to be honest. I was going to try and try Dark Elves, because Dark Elves are good and I should, I should try them, so. But I thought I'd just go what else, because what else are the best? Would he greed? No. It's 
It's annoying because like getting him spread out is is good in a way, but then in another way, he's got tackle pommers, and if I if I uh, keep it compact, you can't. It's harder for him to get hits on good players with him, isn't it? Yeah, Woody's are the best team. Yeah, probably the most powerful team. <laughs> Indeed, careful. Um, that was a huge stun. Huge stun. It looks like it's not, but it stops me dodging him out, doesn't it? Me too. So, actually, huge stun. He's going to keep fouling him until I uh, blitz this guy, so I'm going to have to blitz this guy. That's what I get for blitzing with fucking wrestling instead of bump. <laughs> Jesus Christ. Le ballon est en sécurité. À l'autre équipe de prouver le contraire. Alright, good mid then. I blocked myself from the 2 plus dodge as well, idiot. It is a good thing I didn't start with two plus, yeah. Yeah, exactly. There you go. Careful. Yeah, Woody's. That that's that's exactly that's exactly right, isn't it? That's exactly right. Woody's have a high potential, but Dark Elves are more stable. Yeah, strong and stable, aren't they, Dark Elves? So there may be the but. But then you know, all the highest rated players in the world. Okay, not at the moment because Careful's got Dark Elves, but. Usually the highest rate is ones or wood elves because they just they just are the most powerful, aren't they? And at the end of the day, as careful will find out found out um, <laughs> at the last tournament, if you get diced, you get diced. Don't it? It doesn't matter if you doesn't matter what you what you take. So I feel like you might as well take the team that's the best if you don't get diced. Yeah, exactly, Kadenik, yeah. Yeah. Yeah, I think Wood Elves, Wood Elves are the most powerful, aren't they? Uh, undead, Undead have a slightly better winning percent, but that counts draws as half, right? And dra draws don't win you tabletop tournaments, wins do. So, it's not... It's not as... Much is what it looks like. Uh, but Dark Elves are really good. I mean, don't get me wrong. It's not like there's like one's good and one's shit. It's just the... Hey! That's what you get for greed! <laughs> get the fuck on. No foul for you. Get out of town. Absolutely glorious. Get fucked, you little cunt! <laughs> Fuck off! Right, this is... It's still a bit fucked. Still a bit fucked here, because with this assist, it's going to have to get the blitz on here, unless I just dodge away, which I don't really want... Don't Really don't want to do. He can get all the way to there. Which is nuts. If he makes a dodge, we can get the assist with him. I don't really want to do that, though. Get him over there. You've got one dodge with dodge. And then two dodges without. I might have to not blitz with a mighty blow. Jim Shard. Fuck 
tough, man. I guess with oh I've only got two re-rolls with him on the floor because means I should have dodged him first ah fuck it try and do something next turn yeah Necro stronger in eternally he's not in he's not living in half tabletop Yeah, and exactly, it depends. It, and also, yeah, all the stats are lumped in together, aren't they? Um, so, different tournaments have different rules. So, in some tournaments, Necro will be tier 2, and in some, they'll be tier 1. And, you know, and in some tier 2 teams, in some tournaments, tier 2 will get an extra double. And in some tier 2, they'll get an extra 2 skills and an extra 2 doubles, or whatever, whatever like, the World Cup 1 was that made tier 2 way better. So you know that's gonna that's gonna fuck with his stats a bit as well. Oh wow, the, the armor was a double one as well. So three ones in a row, nothing was gonna work there. Probably only one. Ah, uh, thirteen's not bad though, is it? Maybe twelve since you got the apple. I'll probably get a third reroll. Right, three turns left, two rerolls. Need to not roll shit for a turn or two. <laughs> like these two fucking blitzes with a wrestle guy. Wow. And the mighty blows getting fouled. This is that was a horrible, horrible, horrible turn. The ball down on the blitz was terrible. Because I just needed a push to get the two plus dodge out. That fucking failed. And I lost my strength fog standing as well. Brutal. Really shit fucking turn that was. And then, yeah, the one turn it gets pommed. Hey! Yeah, the thing is, you want, you want TV on the pitch, don't you? That's it. That's the thing. Yeah, fumbles, high TV, here we go, the GFI foul. Because I just couldn't fucking get a push on that guy with strength ball for two turns. Not dead though. And he's get left a gaping hole. So that was nice of him. And there is this player here though. Which is a bit problematic. Oh, look at that, an actual knockdown. Outrageous. Is it worth cutting the corner for the potentially disastrous outcome? No. No, it is not. <laughs> no, absolutely not worth cutting that corner. here because it gives a shit.
Is it worth him getting punched? Yeah, he'll get punched. Good for you. Reroll this one, and then just leave one reroll left, I guess. Uh, only if Andre's stupid, Frank Furter. <laughs> he's got no recovery. He's not going to use it to uh, for damage, is he? I mean, there, are, there is some good damage there, but uh, I think it's a bad... I think it's a really, really bad one. Really bad wizard there, because he's just got no recovery, has he? He wants to use it to win the game, not to maybe make a Kaz. He's done it. Terrible fireball. In my opinion. <laughs> of course, it's better when he hits. When he hits four out of six. And gets two dice on the ball. The only way he could. Then it's better. <laughs> when he knocks over four out of six and gets two dice on the ball, the only possible way he could get two dice on the ball, then it's better. But um, realistically, I think that was a shit fireball. Bad decision. <laughs> Andrew. Zero out of ten. <laughs> well, not, not zero out of ten, but I don't think it was good. I mean, there was potential good value there with, uh, you know, hitting my best player. My two best players, it hits my... Uh, hits my Edge five and my movement nine, so it does hit two good players that are both armor seven. So there was there was something in, um, but I don't have to play around a wizard anymore. You know, I don't have a wizard anymore. Um, so it makes his drive. Uh, sorry, he doesn't have the wizard anymore. So it makes his his drive harder, doesn't it? I don't have to play around the wizard anymore, and it makes his drive harder on offense now because he doesn't have the wizard in his pocket. So. I didn't. I didn't think it was a great decision. Personally, so soon. I honestly wasn't wizard baiting because I just thought he wouldn't do it. <laughs> I genuinely thought he wouldn't even consider it. But now, of course, he's going to get the ball and and get the recovery. Disgustingly. Disgustingly, with uh, by knocking over four out of six, he has managed to get a get. Two dice on the ball and a recovery. Insane result, like, you know, really, really incredibly lucky it was. I don't think he should have tried for something so lucky, but it worked, so I guess. If it worked, it had to be the right decision, right? <laughs> because it was all four that he needed like it was four it was it was all four it was he needed all four he needed these two down to get the recovery and he needed these two down to get the two dice <laughs> so or he needed these three sorry he needed these three down he needed these four down for recovery and he got three of them down with a wizard and one with a blitz results oriented thinking tells me that was the correct play though yeah, yeah, exactly. Hello. <laughs> hey. It's the big peen. Did you see I've the bear that I drew? No, I didn't actually. I haven't been around for a while. <laughs> nah. Really busy with work lately. Yeah. I've been injected with coffee though, so I have I have a little bit of time to to pop in here and. Uh, glorious. Oh, hey, he's failed. Rolling. It's a good fail. Ouch. That's uh. Potentially not scatter. a good scatter. Well. Oh, fucking knew I'd roll a one. For fuck's sake, man. How can I just not be lucky? <laughs> Anything but a fucking one, man. And then don't get the push. Oh, an absolute 
shit turn so far. All right, got the scatter. And it's in a tackle zone. But the fucking reroll's gone. Still a chance though. You're telling me there's a chance. Sacre bleu. Every bit planned. Yeah, I mean that was the plan to get the to get to get the scat of the oh, no, ball and hopefully no. go into the crowd. <laughs> but um, it actually was planned in, in some in some capacity. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I mean, it worked very it worked very well. <laughs> <laughs> but yes, the plan was to to scatter the ball in the crowd to the point of dodging with a guard to fill in the square to get the chain, which oh. then <laughs> spent the fucking reroll and didn't even get the push, <laughs> and then having to waste the blitz. To get the push, but then got ultimate, ultimate scatter, didn't I? I mean, that was really lucky scatter. Yeah. Three out of eight in the crowd, and then one out of eight to go that way. So it was an incredible, incredibly lucky scatter, to be fair. Yeah, I would have dropped the chuckles, but that ruins your games usually. So, uh, <laughs> yeah, don't do that. <laughs> yeah. No, it's, it's not a time for journeyman mind games right now. Nope. <laughs> nope. <laughs> <laughs> I'm out of range of this wrestling that's... tackler, which is good. I felt the spirit of Elp rise up within me to suggest <laughs> that. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, true. Two out of three unthrown would have been alright. That's true, okay, Phil. But I still got I still got the luckiest throw in, didn't I? This wasn't so lucky. <laughs> and the apple fails. Kind of. Uh, two subs, good eh, Nick? Well, he won't be playing in your next game. That's yeah. pretty bad. Yeah, so it half worked. <laughs> it half worked. <laughs> He's not got minus agility if I win this game and the next game. <laughs> <laughs> but I really wanted him for the rest of this game. <laughs> yeah, guard elf is good. Absolutely. Yeah, he can base me. I was, there was nothing really I could do because if I'd gone on the sideline, it would have had the chance for the surf, wouldn't it? If uh, if it, if it had failed, so. Oh, he's got two D on me. Oh shit! Oh, I really should have gone on the sideline then. Eh? At least it's not with tackle. Yep. But he's got me stuck on a tackler. Yeah. Yeah, you have to reroll there. <clears throat> oh, he's made it tough <laughs> he's for you. fucking got this guy on. <laughs> Flip me. That is the name of your team? Yeah, he's had some good rolls. I mean, I had some good rolls as well, I guess, the turn before. All right, he can go here. It's made it real difficult. And then he could dodge and hit him. Kikoni's voice seems a bit low. Hmm. I don't know. Um, I can turn you up a bit. Right, turned up a bit. Um, We're louder now, boys. So 2D him. Right, 2D him first, because that's got to happen. Right, I think 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6... Seven, eight is all I've got to do, isn't it? I think anything else is going to add rolls and not going to help. <laughs> Glorious. <laughs> My butt was so firmly clinched at that moment. Three out of 
Three Kaz is, is pretty bad. <laughs> um, but perfect eight turn stall, right? Yep, yep, there was the perfect eight turn <laughs> stall. So yeah, considering the, the cage got annihilated with a fireball and it was very nearly one nil to him. Um, it's not so bad. way better at players down than his. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. So, yeah, yeah, I would regret the, the fireball now, in fair. Yeah. And, I mean, it, it almost seemed, you know, results-oriented thinking almost said that was the correct play, but now results-oriented thinking says that was the absolute incorrect play. So <laughs> now we all have to agree with Jim. <laughs> <laughs> That's true. <laughs> That's true. It's funny, isn't it? I mean, there was big payoff. There was the Edge 5 Garda, which has stayed out, and there was the Movement 9, and there was a bunch of other players, and there was a few ways of getting the ball down or getting a shot on the ball, but um, he got absolute. I mean, he got really lucky with it, didn't he? And still didn't score, so there you go. <laughs> yeah. And he could have had a fireball for this half, you know? Like, yep. that would have been nice. Or, yeah. or, a, or a, a lightning bolt. <laughs> Or a bolt or whatever. Never agree That'd with Jim. Like, Careful. Wow. Never agree with Jim. <laughs> First roll of blood bowl. <laughs> wow. Stab me in my heart. Careful. <laughs> nah, he's only got move seven, hasn't he? I don't give a shit. If he uh, if he scores a if he scores a one turn with movement seven, no re rolls, an edge three. Then he deserves it. He deserves it. Yeah. I'll yeah, say that's it. it. Well done, Andre. Good for you, fella. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> and I'll mean good for you. I won't mean go fuck yourself. <laughs> I would mean good for you because it's, it's yeah. fair enough, isn't it? Like the fireball was great for like an attrition point of view, but you don't really care about attrition in this type, in this type of a game. And so he only had like a mummy and a white and maybe the zombie over there. Like he had practically nobody that could capitalize on that fireball. So it was just it seemed really bad to me. Yeah, it seemed really bad to me. I, I really didn't think he would... I honestly didn't even think he would go for it. I wasn't even trying to bait it. Because I, I just thought, you know, I'll get everyone far away from his team. <laughs> yeah, exactly. And that's all I was thinking. You know? Yeah, and maybe the attrition fireball helps him win. Careful, but, uh, like, I don't know. It seems rough. Yeah, yeah that's the thing. It, 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 you know, but, yeah, I think... He was in a terrible position to take advantage, but... Yeah, like, I, there's no absolute wrong in that scenario, certainly, but I think that's... Uh, yeah, it was greedy, wasn't it? In my opinion, yeah. It was greedy. It was greedy. Yep. And it's all about risk versus reward and all that, isn't it? So... Yep. No, I don't have a wizard mode of Kishta. It was it's just Andrew had one. Oh, do you know what? If I had 150k, I could have just bought a wizard stadium. That's probably what I should have done. Shit. <laughs> Would have been pretty good, yeah. Probably shouldn't have bought the reserve. No, I needed the reserve. I mean, I'm happy that I got the reserve already, right? Because I've lost three players yeah. in the first half, so... Yeah, I'm exactly. happy I went to 13 now. <clears throat> it's all about just winning the next match, isn't it? You can't really look ahead, I don't think. Oh, well, you can, but I don't think you should. <laughs> Maybe yeah, if your exactly. first round's against goblins, you can look ahead. <laughs> right? Yep. Oh, wow. Palm worked that time. <laughs> it's unfortunate. Yep. That's gonna work sometimes, isn't it? It's just, I really need my chaos to come back now. Don't know how I'm gonna mount any kind of defense with a, without any without a ball sacker and without players and another cars. Hello, Necro Impotence. Uh, not going great. Severe lack of players. That's when you're at your best. It's fine. Glorious. Thank you very much, Audrey Dolly. Thanks for staying fantastic for a, a human plus a beaver pregnancy. <laughs> and in months. Glorious. A human plus a beaver pregnancy. Like that. 
Oh. oh, look how fucked I am. This is fun. <laughs> You're you fine. Don't there's, worry about it. There's one shit player on the pitch. Only good players exposed. Oh. It's fine. <laughs> yeah. Yeah, two, two shit players on the pitch. And, uh, yeah. Ouch. Just go for the offset LOS. And, uh, and, you know, perfect DM. It'll be fine. <sighs> nah, I think I like spread. No, I, I agree. I'm just that's just the meme, the meme suggestion. <laughs> oh, okay. <laughs> it's tough though. It's, I just don't know. I mean, which one of these three do I protect? I, can't, I want to protect them all. <laughs> no, you have to admit, if you that, that would be pretty, that'd be pretty legendary if you offset LOS and, and it works somehow. <laughs> it would be. It would be glorious. I mean, he's got a fucking guard, ghoul. But so he's just gonna all man's LOS probably. So it doesn't like. Doesn't yeah. accomplish anything. Yeah, exactly, really. Yeah. Miach Five's got to be the best, right? Keep him back. Right. Yeah. Ouch. Seems like Jimmy has an extensive knowledge of human beaver hybrids. <laughs> <laughs> True squirrel dude. Have you seen my have you ski have you seen my squirrel dude picture squirrel dude? Squirrel dude? Squirrel dude? I'm quite happy with Squirrel Dude and, and Super Kikoni that I've done so far, to be honest. I'm sad I missed it. <laughs> I'll show you them after I'll show you them after the match because obviously Sweet. this video will be going on YouTube, won't it? And uh, yeah. a random a random bit of gimp on the screen wouldn't pro would probably be a bit shit for a lot of people. So um, I'll show you after the match. Some of them are some of them are proper shit. Kurgol and Soul of the Morning are just like blobs. <laughs> <laughs> but uh, but uh, some of some of them I've done a bit more on. I just want to get them all to the standard where I can shrink them down and put them, you know, on the screen, and then I'll yeah. uh, then I'll do them properly. But both Squirrel Dude and Super Kikoni are at that point where I think they could get scaled down and put on the screen. Oh, nice cheeky, nice cheeky stun. Oh, Touchback, fantastic. That really stops him picking up the ball. <laughs> I was just about to that say. That was the perfect player, Jesus. <laughs> yeah. Oh, and then the touchback. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, if, if that had been on the back line, oh. and even though I'd gone deep, I could have still got people in range for the turn after. I love being a fraction of a second behind, so you can just give me all these spoilers here. <laughs> oh, sorry. Rebel would be disappointed. <laughs> <laughs> I'll wait twenty. I'll wait forty eight hours. I do apologize. <laughs> <laughs> and whatever you do, don't give me any tactical advices. Oh dear. Oh, sidestep. Let's go here. <laughs> get fucking I'll be right pommed. back, Jim. Let's get pumped. Oh, death. Good. Flip me, guys. They killed my dog. <laughs> what are you gonna do? Time to buy a new collar, I guess. <laughs> it's pretty lucky because I was planning on going to the shops to buy a spade anyway. So <laughs> I can use it to dig the drain with my dead dog. Hey. <laughs> Flip me, guys. <laughs> the good news is they stole my car as well, so when I'm giving my new dog walkies, it'll be, uh, I'll get a bit of exercise. <sighs> oh, fuck's sake. I probably don't even have the players for a one turn in now, right? Yeah, bad news is we're not high TV anymore. <laughs> Good news is we get a wizard every game if we win. Seen that Norse Arava. I 
Right, there's nothing I can do with his cage, is there? So let's just wait. Wait for the half to be over. Flip me. Oh, Ninja Girl Jill. <laughs> Thanks. It was gone a lot better. <laughs> it was gone a lot better a few turns ago. <laughs> but now two Kaz here is, uh, has got us just playing for overtime. <clears throat> I've returned, sorry about that. No problem at all. Big ping. Oh. <laughs> what I really need well now, stacked. what I need now is a strong arm thrower, right? Yeah. <laughs> See, it was the correct play all, all along, Jim. <laughs> <laughs> Who knew? Help. <laughs> <Nope. laughs> I mean, yeah, he had me on his, on his side the entire time. Whereas on this team, I think I'm just a lineman, right? That's it. Uh, I think so. You're probably dead as well. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, probably, <laughs> probably yeah, just been fucking. Going. Oh, there you go, KO, chilling out, safe. And ruins is badly hurt. Is that badly hurt? I, I would be the one KO player just chilling out. <laughs> yeah, yeah. Take Miss next now. game. Miss next game. Oh, badly hurt. So I've taken one badly hurt and four, four, well, two missed next games and two deaths. So the team is absolutely wrecked for the next match. Yeah, it's really rough. Yeah. <coughs> Gotta think that fireball was correct if he was actually facing you again next match. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> <laughs> oh, yeah. I don't know why I went all bunched up here. I can stay spread out and force him to spread out and then run around a bit because elves. <coughs> no, I could have gone this way so that if he wants to hit him, he's got to go the other way, right? That would have been clever. That's all right. We don't watch this channel for clever plays, Jim. <laughs> 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 yeah, don't I am, yeah. Yeah. Uh yeah, I was doing well. I was doing well <laughs> a few minutes ago, but it's all gone pear shaped since. Who's Max one one five? God. I love how this this man basically has a halfling undead team. Because the two trees. <laughs> it's yeah. ridiculous. <laughs> yeah, they are incredible. I mean, yeah. When uh, when an undead team has plus movement trees instead of uh, mummies, that's pretty good. <sighs> no, I'm just, I'm, I'm, I'm incredibly jealous as well because my undead team, my, my mummies are just boring. They're level three each, you know, and they're just, they have nothing but garden sand for them and I'm just crying <laughs> in, yeah. inside. <laughs> That's literally what I get. All of my fucking mummies make it a grab, you know? <laughs> yeah, exactly. You're just like, oh, why do I have this? <laughs> <laughs> like, fuck's sake. Fuck's yeah. sake. Fucking grab. <laughs> really, game? <laughs> I'd fire the whole team if I could, to be honest, but... <laughs> <laughs> fucking grab. <laughs> <laughs> Oh dear. <laughs> Hello Yuri Styles. Yep, ready for a joke. Hello Tom and Amen. Um I will not make five touchdowns before the end of the half. Hopefully I'll make one. Um or win the coin toss for overtime. I mean you you know you could give him grab or you could go the Andre route and give him break tackle, which will definitely be important in this game. Yeah. I mean break tackle's better okay. when you movement when you when you strength six at least, you know. Three. It is, but you're still movement three. Like I still strength <laughs> it's yeah. just it's so bad. Yeah, most still, of the time, yeah. Yeah, I still don't think it's good, yeah. <laughs> yeah. Don't get me wrong, I still don't think it's good. But um oh right, we can move quite far here. Because he can just... only reach there. So this is safe here. Pas bon se 
fuck's sake. <laughs> what a stupid game. <laughs> it was going so well for you at first. He was removing nobody. Yeah, exactly. Yeah, the first few turns. <laughs> Just... But as Jahanian said, there's plenty of time for it to change, and, and change it yep. did. <laughs> That's Blood Bowl. That's... <laughs> yeah. Oh, wow. Good luck, Wayne Farrer. Right. The waitress was waiting as patiently as she could while the smart-ass man was dawdling over the breakfast menu. He says, I never return to a restaurant until it, unless at least one of the sausages are... Unless... Blah, until I can learn to speak English. I never return to a restaurant unless at least one of the sausages I'm served is a match in size for my own. The waitress replied, in that case, sir, perhaps you should take a look at the children's menu. <laughs> there you go. <laughs> that one was pretty good, Yuri. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. yeah, that was pretty good. At least it wasn't the classic German sense of humor. <laughs> 6-1-0 Woodies versus 5-2-0 Kenry. Wow, that's, that's just, a very good record, isn't it, for Kenry from Knorr's? Just yeah. no punchline, and they insert the word Christmas man in there just to make Jimmy giggle. <laughs> <laughs> Absolutely, yeah. Christmas man's always the best punchline. <laughs> there was something else amazing as well that Sinai told me, oh man, just quite recently, it's like some, you know, absurd, literal words for something. Brilliant. can't remember what it was, though. I mean, that's not, it's not this is shit story. <laughs> and it's not funny at all. But it was re it was something that was really funny. It was incredible. Just bait him into really bad surfs constantly, Wayne Ferrer. That's how you win. <laughs> yeah. Right. This guy can now reach. Look a dog. Oh. So. You're down to a full elf team now. <laughs> yeah. Oh god, he's got he's got to he's got to make the sacrifice, hasn't he? The fucking wig reckless has got to make the sacrifice. That's the way you have to look at it. Before you weren't a full elf team, you were an anomaly. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> yeah. Now this is a proper elf team. Yep, exactly. Still the chance. Absolutely shut on. <laughs> <laughs> Might as well re-roll this, seeing as... Oh no, no, because it could go overtime. <laughs> Whoa! What an idiot. <laughs> was... Whew, I was pretty close to re-rolling that. So I'm yeah. thinking, I just need one re-roll for the one turn. But no, there's, there's overtime, isn't there? Just refresh the stream here. Appear to be about five seconds behind now. Here we go. I mean, best case overtime. There might not be overtime. You might... <coughs> He might, he might, he might score early and try to win in normal time, but I think that'd be a mistake. I don't think he will, because even though I've got no players, <laughs> with six, you know, I've got six, potentially eight players. That's that's well enough to score, isn't it? Well, he's got better chances just to take it into overtime, like yeah, much better than just scoring twice quickly or tr and you know trying to turn you over again. Yeah, so I think I think he's he's much better off just trying to go for attrition. Yeah. Yeah. It looks like that's what he's doing. So, yeah. At the moment, there's enough for to one turn. Yeah, it's on Brand Hill, but <laughs> every turn, <laughs> you know, there's still four more turns of blitz and foul, right? A dirty yeah, player foul, going. a pom blitz and a dirty player foul. Hey, oh! Now here's a question <coughs> with overtime. Ah <laughs> oh, yes, <laughs> glorious. Oh, I could I could go save or I could fucking mighty blow blitzes fucking. Uh... Glorious. Okay, let's go. Let's be greedy. Greet him right back. Yeah. Glorious. Thank you very much, Vigente. <laughs> Vigente BB. Thank you very much for the sun. Welcome to Team Fantastic. Glorious. Uh, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. We can get back to there, so it means we probably want him here.
This is a bit shit. Fuck off. Really, game? Really? My fucking suck. You know, I think you, I think you played incorrectly there. You should have found his plodger. I don't know. Yeah, I should have done. Yeah, <laughs> seems a bit bad. At least push him so that he doesn't hit my, hit my wrestle and 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 another player. <laughs> you know. <laughs> you can make sixty dodges with the irrelevant elf, but you can't power his plodger. <laughs> <laughs> well, at least it stops him blitzing the movement, doesn't it? Yeah. Out of dodge. So. It does. Yeah. Fucking hell, that was horrible. It was horrible for him, obviously, one in 36. Is, uh, the, the ball's all the way down here. It's it's irrelevant to me. <laughs> There's nothing I can do with the ball. <laughs> maybe I could actually, maybe I could reverse field and come back around for it. If he commits heavily here, because he's committing two assists here. And block, maybe I could move it down, down here to try and go make a play for the ball, potentially. He's found dirty play. Yeah, I mean, I'm. I'm gonna go back down for the ball. Yeah. With the four players that I have left alive. <laughs> <laughs> He's trying really hard to give you every chance here. What a nice guy. <laughs> oh, I'm not really sure if the term overcommit applies when you're when your uh, your opponent only has like four players on the pitch. <laughs> so it does not. It does because they... no, it does in this. It does in this case. Yeah, but <laughs> yeah, it does. And look at that. Look, he's he's committing everyone. Yeah, this is crazy. Malmia did it to me as well. It was brilliant. I uh, I played his dwarves one time with with high elves, I think, as well. Funnily enough, and uh, I just hid in one corner. And he, you know, moved out to try and hunt me down and kill my players. And he left the ball a little bit undefended. And then obviously, elves a movement eight and nine, and I ran over and got the ball off him. And he was, uh, he was not the happiest bunny in the world. Now, if you had the fireball pitch, <laughs> we see an area, <laughs> we see an area of an attack there. So. <laughs> Time to work some magic. <laughs> he won't. He won't see this coming. I <laughs> mean, <laughs> <laughs> no, okay. Maybe I should have made a bunch of GFIs there and everything, but now these guys could have moved over a bit or something. I don't know. Cut the corner. Stand there. Have those two there, might have been better. Because it's not really nah. threatening. Nah, if you make GFOs, you fall over and die, it's fine. Don't yeah. worry about it. <clears throat> Where's he going? <laughs> He's running back, he is trying to link up and make a cage. Yeah, I guess he does have the movement. I guess he is, yeah. Things. Oh, fair enough. Maybe it was maybe it was four D chess from him, eh? M making me think that he overcommitted by, while skillfully uh, maneuvering around and not actually overcommitting. That is some serious juking. I refuse to believe that went through his head. <laughs> 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 but the fact that it's a possibility terrifies me. <laughs> so. I don't know, Hundry's a good player. He's played pretty well this game. He has, yeah. Yep, the only thing was the uh was the wizard, wasn't it? And that, that wasn't bad. It was just uh, a bit greedy. Yeah. Le 
Oh, really? Um, it went it went my way for a bit. <laughs> but yeah, taking a bit of a pounding. Bit of a pounding, boy. -o. Sorry, he's got the the ninja half elf, uh, half elf, yes, ninja high elf squad coming around. <laughs> I've got this. <laughs> Look, the opponent's ignored it. He's not even basing you. He's just like, ah, these guys won't do anything. <laughs> oh, fuck off. <laughs> Jesus. Well, all right. <laughs> you know, you, you had a team at one point in this game. <laughs> yeah. yeah, believe it or not. <laughs> <laughs> the, 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 the squad is retreating. <laughs> Believe it or not, we had we had a team at one one stage in this fucking game. <laughs> yeah, perfect idea. One man fell the bomber. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> oh, God. Three deaths as well. Three deaths and two missed next game. It's not even. It's not even like a bunch of badly hurt. It's just completely yeah. ruined. There's, there's a point at which you're not even sure you want to win this game. <laughs> <laughs> there's certainly no point winning now. It was. It's just yeah. a hurt. It's just a hurt. Uh, hurt Andre, isn't it? Really? <laughs> yeah. <laughs> maybe get a, Maybe get some more money from the ass. To be fair, the ass is. Uh, is a thing, isn't it? Here you go. He's hurting his team for you. Glorious. Evening the odds. <clears throat> That's what we like to see. <laughs> yeah, I don't think I can do one turn with these players, but... If the three KOs come back, then seven's enough. Oh, but he's got two stand firm mummies on the LOS. <laughs> <laughs> so it's win the coin toss is, is what we're looking at. Oh, those, those mummies are madness. Goodness. Yeah. Yeah, we're looking at win the coin toss. Or get a get a get maybe get a riot or a or a quick snap. Yeah it is. It is Vigente. <laughs> After those yeah. KO rolls. Yes, it is. <laughs> they're just... They're having a lie down, that's all. <laughs> <laughs> they got it. <laughs> got in the KO pit with, uh, with, the, with the big pain, and he's just like, hmm, have a beer, folks. <laughs> <laughs> and they're like, oh, we'll stick around. <laughs> <laughs> Not get mur murdered by the the tree mummies, you know. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, if the KOs had come back, there'd have been a chance of the one turn, but yeah, yeah. not like this. <laughs> <laughs> you should roll better KOs. Thank you for good day. <laughs> yeah, yeah. There were there were two ones last time, and now there was two ones this time as well. Brilliant. If you all man Zillow us, you'll confuse them out of this this half, basically. That's, that's what happens. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> I need to set for the riot, don't I? With the riot, there's a chance. <clears throat> yeah, there is money on the line, Durham, because there's the ass, the ass money, isn't there? We're both ass men, Andre and I. <laughs> Isles are on right, they said. Um, so... Oh yeah, Game Crash, I should be spending as much time as possible hoping that his game crashes. There you go. <laughs> That's the best strat right now. <laughs> <laughs> I mean, it literally is my best strat, isn't it? It's just take as much time yeah. as possible and hope he's in a net crashes. <laughs> Fucking stupid. Or his power flash, anything, you know. It's, it's all good. Yeah. You've got a couple of outs. None of them are actually in the game, but you have a couple of outs. <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. We've got some outs. He could have set up for offense on a uh, on a on a defensive drive, you know. Yeah, 
Ja. Kan jeg få Bare en sundhed? Bare så gerne i dag, Jeg mener, der er en chance her, ikke? Jeg mener, der er en chance. Ja. Yeah. It is indeed yesterday, yeah. but still, it's better than nothing. Right, so we get a mighty blow, a ghoul. And got a reroll, but he got a reroll as well. But I need them more because I need to win the toss and use all my rerolls to win. Of course, I have don't hit that. I've hit ghouls three times with a block tackle mighty blow and I haven't knocked one over. Chaos. Two back. Now win the toss. Lost the toss. No. GG. That's no, okay, you'll turn them over. Hmm. Just make sure your most important players are protected. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Go. Oh well. GG. We'll drop the early GG on him. <laughs> <laughs> I mean, winning the toss, there would have been a chance. Winning the toss, there would have been a chance. With six players, there really would have been a chance, wouldn't there? I mean, a strength yeah. four to blitz with, make a hole, and then three catches to run through, and uh, somebody to pass it to them. There really would have been a chance. But not like this. <laughs> No, the game could glitch and you could roll a perfect defense and a blitz at the same time. That would be hand. Yeah. Um, and, and an imperfect offense where he said some shit. <laughs> yeah, exactly. Yeah. But I don't think we're going to get that. Because he's only got to worry about a blitz, right? So that's all he's going to set up with in mind. It looks like he is, so. You say quoi, Jim? At least I've got re-rolls for the uphill blocks on the ball anyway, so that's something, isn't it? An extra re-roll, five re-rolls to try and turn him <laughs> over. Oh, baby. Flip me, guys. Flip me, guys. <laughs> we get to re-roll everything. This is really good. We've got a really good chance now, guys. We've got so many rerolls. <laughs> you could reroll those deaths, but. <laughs> <laughs> Flip me. <laughs> I think I think the uh, the correct play here is to kill your team before he can, so that you deny him SPP. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> oh, thank you very much. Thank you very much, Ninja Girl Jill. <laughs> Um, five versus five rerolls. Yeah, crazy because we we both. Well, I mean, the, there wasn't a second half, so we both saved our rerolls, and then there's been two cheering fans. <laughs> yeah, that's 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 yeah, it has. <laughs> If he fails to pick up, there's a chance. There really is a chance, isn't there? There's a one in nine he fails to pick up, and then there's a chance. So. <laughs> Imagine if he greeted that push. Flip me. Oh, come on, fail the pickup, that would be incredible. Pickup is very failable, to be fair. That is that is absolutely something that could happen. Yeah, he has no sure hands players either, so... Yeah, so now it's a 1 in 3, it's not even a 1 in 9 anymore. No. Well.
Yeah, Mardukishtar. There's, 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 there's a chance to survive falling 35,000 feet as well. Because uh, a lady did. That's madness. <laughs> 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 How was she not disintegrated? <laughs> I don't know, but she she fell. She 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 landed, and she was like she was fine. Minor injuries. <laughs> Are you serious? Wait, wait. <laughs> is this a real thing? Yeah, that's yeah. incredible. <laughs> <What>? <laughs> yeah, hundred percent. Vesna Vulovich, stewardess who survived thirty three thousand footfalls. Sorry. Sorry, th only 33,000 feet. She died age 66. That's a, that's a big difference. You can't survive 35,000 feet. Yeah. yeah, yeah, that's fair. <laughs> <Okay. laughs> 2,000 feet makes all the difference. Minor injuries versus death. It's fine. <laughs> oh, no, she, she, absolutely, she was absolutely destroyed. Um, the 33,000 one was absolutely destroyed. But there was, there was another woman who... Um, who fell must have not fell thirty three thousand feet. Then there was one. There was one person that survived with like basically no damage. But the, that one who fell thirty three thousand foot was <laughs> was absolutely brutalized. <laughs> to be fair, <laughs> Mate, he's given us a one day on the ball here, hasn't he? Yeah, yeah, he has. It's madness. That is madness. I mean, it's also Sparta, isn't it? Yeah, <laughs> so, I should go uh, Spartan kick him right do, in the ghouly face. Do I go for the tackle? Hit one, two, three, four, five, six, six, seven, eight. Do you know, because that's minus three dodge is really bad. But it gives us a five plus to hit get the ball free rather than a six plus. And then the edge five would be able to um, react. No. Yeah. I've got to go for. I've got to go for the one D, haven't I? I guess. Yeah. I can still re-roll it if it's not a power. Yeah. Operation power the blodger. Yeah. Effect. Oh, you could assist though. I could have two dice on it if he just leaps in. <laughs> <laughs> you could. <laughs> nah. nah. All right, one D. Now just don't misclick. Yeah, I know. I nearly did as well. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Tackle would have got it. Fuck's sake. Should have had strip ball. <laughs> Should have done. done. I mean, leap, leap, leap strip was going to be the play as well rather than guard. Oh, yeah. But um, I mean, you can't you can't turn down guard, yeah. Get fucked, mummy. <laughs> How'd you like them biscuits? <laughs> oh, it's at some point, ninja, you just accept it. <laughs> <laughs> I think, you know, you just get worn down, you know, like like a woman in an abusive relationship. Wow! At one point, you just give in to it. <laughs> <laughs> and you're just fine with getting your ribs broken every other week. <laughs> just all right. <laughs> Jimmy gets bad for choice. <laughs> 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 Don't watch the bar, yeah. Don't you? <laughs> oh. You know. <laughs> 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 Ha <laughs> ha
<laughs> please don't ban me, Twitch. <laughs> yeah, please. <laughs> oh, shit. <laughs> At least it got some laughs. Get fucked, you little cunt. <laughs> Fuck off. <Yeah. laughs> exactly. <laughs> <laughs> All right. <laughs> so, so, so there's your answer, Ninja. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. No. Honestly, at some point you just you just accept that it's you know it is what it is, and it's just a fucking you know the game just fucks you, and you can't win them all, and that's it. And, that, and, and once once you accept that, then it's all right, isn't it? <laughs> Can you imagine how Ninja would feel if his question was the reason you got banned from Twitch? Hopefully <laughs> 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 not. You can't. You can't get banned for jokes, can you? Can no, you? Yeah, I just, just probably. You probably can. To be fair, you probably can. <laughs> you can get banned for drawing a fucking nipple for fuck's sake. What's that about? Yeah. Age of the Snowflakes, isn't it? It is. Yeah. Blood Bowl 2020 will definitely fix everything. It will not be a case of Games Workshop making the game worse for money. Definitely not. Definitely not. Cannot see that outcome at all. <clears throat> right, I'm, I'm going to try and regroup and have another go at the ball. I mean, that is fair. I'm too new for you. You can, you can, depending on the joke. Yeah, they have been <laughs> for jokes. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. But I don't, I don't think that's one of them. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, no, it's not. It's not as bad as it could have been, was it? <laughs> yeah. <laughs> yeah. Well, I was just glad you didn't go further. Yeah. <laughs> 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 Yeah, no nipples on Twitch. I don't understand it. <clears throat> yeah, it's very sad, isn't it? I mean, I do understand it, conceptually. Yeah. I don't have to agree with it to understand it. Yeah. Right. Nobody was removed in, like, the first two turns. That's pretty incredible after the way the game had been going. <laughs> <laughs> so I guess I will have no choice but to migrate to Sage's stream once Shim gets banned. Can't wait to look at that bearded hobgoblin all day. <laughs> oh dear. Yeah, exactly, Squirrel Dude. Yeah, that'd be fair enough, wouldn't it? Yeah. Yeah, that'd be fair enough. But um I wouldn't I wouldn't tell that kind of joke. Yeah, Tom Brendel. Two strength six mummies, they're tree mummies. Yeah, two strength six mummies. Yeah, crazy, crazy mummies. But I mean, that's the thing. I think honestly, I think the strength six mummies may have been worse than strength five mummy, mummies in this match, because if he'd had strength five mummies, I would have maybe tried to fight them, and then maybe that would have been a bad idea. Why did I protect the fucking mighty blow and not the fucking guard? That was idiotic. Yeah, like the strength six is not just an auto take on on the mummies, um, like because you could you could have block on them. And yeah. that's a that's a big deal as well. Like, uh, yeah, I probably would have gone block, and then they both would have died the very next match because Nuffle would have hated me. Yes, <laughs> yes, that's true, Adon. That's true. But you know, potentially, potentially, uh, conceptually, um, yeah. going against strength five mummies, you might be tempted to try a one D or a two D on them, and then that might cost you positionally. Whereas. Maybe the better, like it's all maybes and everything, but and maybe it would have been better to just not engage with them at all. And with strength six, you don't have a choice, you can't engage with them at all. <laughs> uh. <clears throat> <laughs> yeah, it was pretty lucky that he didn't die, wasn't it? Though, I mean, admittedly, if I had the foresight to know that both of my mummies were going to roll plus strength, I would definitely take plus strength yeah. on them. Yeah, yeah, it's pretty good. I mean, it's just pretty good against most cool. teams, yeah. isn't it? <laughs> like, it's still really good against against this team. It's just, um, yeah, I don't know. It's not just anything, is it? I don't know, I don't know what I'm saying. I'm just babbling incoherently. No, you take, you take sidestep on them. I can't go for the ball again. Ugh. 
He didn't do an anti-war dancer cage. What is this madman? Yeah, he's got guard both corners though, so it's good enough. And he had loads of tackle zones and that. <laughs> oh, fucking, I just can't. Oh, I could have re-rolled that. I just... Oh, he hasn't got block. All right. <laughs> good job I didn't re-roll it then, eh? Yeah. I'm like, fuck's sake, I'm never gonna knock down oh, a fucking, fucking ghoul. Bellend. Fucking ever. <laughs> <laughs> he says as he knocks down a ghoul. And then, but yeah, then I knocked him down because. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. You're like, wait, how did that happen? <laughs> I saw the block and the one above him and then just thought he had block. Oh, dear. <laughs> right, maybe a crack at the cage next turn. Maybe. Maybe. Maybe game. Maybe. <laughs> What's going through his head right now? Ça cherche clairement le corps à corps. Who Andrew Andrew said? Yeah. Yeah. Um, Put some thoughts in there. What's going through his head? Probably. Ay, 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 senor ding dong. Yeah. Yeah, probably. Hello, you see. Maybe that could get me banned. <laughs> yeah, probably. <laughs> I'm trying to cover it up with a blanket of humor. It's okay. <laughs> 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 we're, we're throwing the towel over that one, Jim. <laughs> <laughs> no in Spanish, Frankfurter, but I've got no idea what a, what a Spanish accent is. <laughs> so I just go Mexican. <laughs> Plus it's The Simpsons, isn't it? It was a Simpsons reference rather than a genuine attempt at, uh, at an impression. Um... Good morning, Skuro. Um, as you can see from my tons of players on the pitch, it's actually not gone that bad. It was terrible because there was there was only six, there was only four on the pitch at one point, but they made two out of three, and he's made no removals in four turns. So it's actually, although it looks terrible, <laughs> the overtime's actually gone pretty fucking well. Ça sent la bonne grosse poignade. I was really disappointed that he was not a cigar smoking Spaniard. <laughs> Fair enough, It turns out being five players down negatively impacts your chances of winning. Who would have thought, Pedro Jack? Yeah. Who would have thought? Yeah, it does a little bit. Why did he, why did he move that zombie there? Right. Oh, this is the odd one anyway. Shit. Tackle it. Well, you could base the ball, which means he loses the game every time. That's true, yeah. Yeah. <laughs> Fuck, that is the that is the what all the pro players do. Face the ball. Yeah. Can't lose them. It's what Knorr would do. It's uh, it's fine. <laughs> um, Although he would be calculating an impossible surf right now. But <laughs> <laughs> He's like, you see this zombie over here with wrestle and tackle? I can I can surf him. That'll matter for this game. <laughs> yeah. Two red with the tackle's pretty shit though, because he's so far away and he'd have to dodge through tackle twice. Um, but what other play do you have? I mean, it's like you're just going to—it's just going to be a crummy screen otherwise. Yeah, I'm, I'm going for the—I'm thinking about the six plus for two D. Oh, yeah. That's what I'm thinking. Green dice wins. Let's go. Let's go, boys. Part part of the way there. Ah! 
I'll fail, roll the one on the GFI, fuck's sake. <laughs> Didn't roll a six. <laughs> Had to do the GFI. <laughs> <laughs> Fucking GFI fail. Ball is still based. <laughs> and the ball is based, yeah. <laughs> yeah, I can't lose now. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. I mean, there was a chance, wasn't there? Six plus for 2D on the ball with Wrestle is pretty good. And then, yeah. um... Yeah, the dice load's a bit weird, isn't it? The dodge was a two, then the GFI was a one, then the dodge was a two. <laughs> it doesn't show the reroll now. Great, great coding work, Sinai. Perfect. <laughs> well done. Yeah, maybe I could have tried another screen for another turn. He, well, he had gone back, so I could have maybe tried another shitty screen for another turn. I still had six players. Five players to screen. And then maybe there'd have been a better chance with everybody more central, but... Really, if I got the pal there, he was kind of, you know, a little bit free to get it, wasn't he, potentially? And obviously... Or he could have just got it and run away and punted and stuff, so... I think that was alright, a 6+. plus, a <laughs> 6 plus for 2D! Ugh... <sighs> Thanks, but I think the uh, I think the time for good luck has gone now. I think everyone gets knocked over now, and uh, it's a loss. Well, uphill, uphill to try and power blodger, I guess. <laughs> Maybe I was better just going for the up. No, because the uphill or about dodging as well, wouldn't I? So. <laughs> Yeah, but can you can you imagine the winning scenario for this, where you where you actually steal the ball, run down the pitch, score, win the game, and Andre's only comment after the game when he's asked by you know the interviewers and everything is just, "Well, he called me Bludger." <laughs> <laughs> yeah. yeah, that'd be incredible. <laughs> Ouch! Absolute Dyson. I did try my best, yeah. I don't think there was much I could have done better. That's the thing, isn't it? By going for it that turn, everyone's out of position for next turn, whereas if I put everyone in the middle and then gone for it, maybe right. there would be oh. a bit more of a chance. I'll be right back again. Okie dokie. Yeah, to be fair, I mean this undead team has got two tackle bombs. It's, it's a really good, it's a really good team versus high elves. To be fair, with the two tackle bomb and uh, the dirty players and stuff, and especially when I never knock over his ghouls, that helps him obviously. And he was lucky, wasn't he? He was lucky. <laughs> Another miss next game. <laughs> He's made seven cas, six of which are at least miss next game. So, yeah, at least it wasn't the goblins. Yep, it does. I'm gonna go through there to hit him, but I need to cancel that assist somehow. I guess I can't cancel the assist. Strip would have been alright, wouldn't it?
<laughs> yeah, the mad. Yeah, yeah, it's fair enough. But that's it. You know, when you when you've when you've had it happen this often, you get used to it, don't you? And just kind of accept it. I think. Sage loves to loves to go on about uh, Blood Bowl Zen, and there's there's an element of truth to it, it but I think it's more like Blood Bowl abuse. <laughs> Eventually, you just get fucked by the dice that many times that it's it's just not that big a deal anymore, is it? How much attrition? A decent amount. <laughs> A decent amount of attrition. <laughs> Seven cards of which three were deaths and three were missed next game. So, even if I'd miraculously won, <laughs> I'm completely screwed for the next match. All right. Hello! Hello! <sighs> Gonna have another chance here. However small. He's gone from building cages to more building highways at this point. <laughs> I never say something as insensitive as that at the map, no. <laughs> don't, don't watch the VOD. <laughs> don't watch the VOD. <laughs> By the way, <laughs> don't watch the VOD. <laughs> not because it disproves what he just says, but because it's, it's a terrible game, definitely not worth rewatching. It's fine. Yeah. Definitely, definitely not going up on YouTube anytime soon. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Right, dodging for the uphill pow. I mean, could get the leap in. It's not insane to get the leap in. And then it would be a 1D. Dodging for a 1D, but then there's no recovery, right? So I need to, I need to dodge in, uphill, pow him. And then dodge away, get it, pass it. So I have to I have to go for the uphill, even though even though it's worse. This is where it happens, boys. This is oh, why right. they call call them the flip me guys. <laughs> Unfortunately, <laughs> not. <laughs> No, because they, they did a flip right in front of him. <laughs> yeah, yeah, he did. That's he why did. they got the flip, you guys, yeah. Yeah. <laughs> That's a shame. There was a real chance there, wasn't there? There really was a chance. Uh -huh. I think he, he gave me too much of a chance there, to be honest. He really did, yeah. Well, I mean... I think he should have blitzed the guy. There was a guy blitzed, basing the ball. He could have blitzed him and changed his guy one square forward. Um, it's funny, because that's where I see people play their worst, is when they're really far ahead. Yeah. It's like they get into that mindset of, I'm so safe, I can't be, you know, I can't be uh, beat at this point. Yeah. And then they start making little mistakes, like leaving avenues open and different things like that. It's it's funny. It's a weird psychological thing. Yeah, yeah. It absolutely makes sense, doesn't it? I mean, it was... Yep. He was on cruise control. Thought he couldn't lose, and he almost couldn't. But, yeah, he, one AV breaking the entire match, that's pretty good from getting a bunch of mighty, mighty blow tackle hits, isn't it? Yeah. <laughs> 23. Especially against the ghouls, too. Yeah. <laughs> with, your, with your mighty blow tackle catcher there, yeah. <laughs> 18 blocks to 46. <laughs> it's a classic gym catcher. <laughs> yeah. Oh, dear. But but well played to you both. I thought that was a good game. Yeah, I, th I thought it was a good game and enjoyable, even though, <laughs> even though it was an absolute banging. Um... <laughs> your team is demolished. <laughs> <Good> <laughs> What do you have, like, three players with any amount of skills on the pitch next game? Or... Hey, yeah. 12.30 TV. <laughs> <laughs> no blitzers. <laughs> no blitzers killed. 
seven players. It's perfect. <laughs> Complete team. <laughs> so that was that was a shame, wasn't it? <laughs> just a, just an opportunity to finally give Super Kick Cody some skills, right? I mean, <laughs> <laughs> finally. <laughs> right. Thanks for watching. If you enjoyed it, don't forget to leave a like and subscribe and stay fantastic.